Welcome to QC, where leading technology puts home security in your hands. Thanks for watching, and today we're going to help you set up your new QT Analog HD security system so you can start taking advantage of all the great security features that QC offers. So, let's get to it. First of all, please join the QC family by registering your new device on the QC support portal to receive advantages such as regular updates on products, support for your device, and a record of your purchasing preferences so that we may be of greater assistance to you. Once you're registered, you won't have to provide proof of purchase for services, but we still do recommend that you make sure to keep a record of your model number and save your hardcover quick start guide that came with your purchase for future technical or warranty support. So, if you're ready to assemble your new security system, let's begin. Step 2. Connect your cameras. In setting up your new system, you'll first need to connect your cameras. Please double check to make sure that you have received all of the components listed on the What's Included section of your product's packaging. Please also be sure to connect the cameras and set up your DVR before mounting cameras or installing hardware. Plug the BNC connector, camera only, and power cable into the camera. Then twist and lock the end of the BNC cable to secure the connection. Next, connect the BNC connector, DVR only, into the back of the DVR as shown. Twist and lock each end of the BNC cable to secure the connections. Connect the power cable, DVR only, into one of the available ends of the four-way splitter as shown. Connect the female end of the power splitter into the adapter as shown in the image. As your guide states, please repeat steps A through D for each camera. Step 3. Connect DVR to display. You have two options when connecting the DVR to a display. One way is through an HDMI connection. Plug the included HDMI cable into the DVR's HDMI port. Connect the other end of the HDMI cable to the monitor or TV. Plug the monitor or TV into a surge protector. The other option is through a VGA cable. Plug the VGA cable into the DVR's VGA port. Please note that this cable is not included and that VGA might not support full high definition output. Connect the other end of the VGA cable to the monitor. A 19 inch monitor or larger is highly recommended. Plug the monitor into a surge protector. Step four, connect the mouse. Next, plug the included mouse into the USB port on the back of the DVR. If your model has two USB ports on the back, either one will work. Now, you'll need to connect your router. Plug the included network Ethernet cable into the LAN network port on the back of the DVR. Then, connect the other end of the cable to an open port on your router. You will hear a click when the cable is properly connected. The router is not included with this purchase. Step 6. Powering up the DVR and cameras. Now you can power up the DVR and cameras. Plug the DVR power supply cord into the DC port on the back of your DVR. Plug the DVR power supply or power adapter into a surge protector. This is not included with your DVR. Now plug the camera power supply into a surge protector. You will hear a faint clicking sound when power is activated. Next, turn on the DVR's power switch if your model has one located on the back of the DVR. It may beep as it powers up. The startup wizard will appear on screen after a few minutes. Now you need to complete the startup wizard to configure your NVR. Click on wizard setup to begin. Set your desired language in the first window. Create a security question in case you forgot your password by clicking edit security question in the window you see. If this option is not visible, go to www.q-c.com forward slash support for answer ID 2894. Create a new password for the admin user account. Please make sure to write down your new password for future reference. Set the current date and time and click Next to proceed to the network setup. If the connection is successful, it will display your LAN local area network address. 
click OK to continue. Step 8. Setting up the QT View mobile app. Please download as instructed the free QT View mobile app to your mobile device, available for both Android and iOS. To view your camera on your mobile device, you will need to add your DVR to the QT View mobile app. Launch the QT View mobile app. You may skip the tutorials and select the QR code scanner. Scan the QR code displayed on the label on top of your DVR with your mobile device. Once scanned, the app will return to the login screen. The DVR's ID will appear in the SN serial number section. Enter the password for your DVR and select play. You have now successfully connected your cameras. After completing this process on your first mobile device, repeat step 8 with a new mobile device if desired. That's it. You should be all set up to operate your QT Analog HD system in your home or business environment. Please refer to your quick start guide included with your purchase to learn how to set up your QT view on your computer. We hope you have enjoyed this instructional video for your new device. And if you have additional questions, please visit www.q-c.com forward slash support.